Welcome back. Welcome back to Bothell Real Estate on YouTube. My name is Nanan. I'm a local realtor in Bothell, Washington. I love living in Bothell. That's why I love serving my community. In today's video, we're continuing with top five Bothell. I'm taking you to the top five locations near Bothell for day trips. These are places that are easy to drive to, fun to visit, and they make living in Bothell that much more exciting. Let's get going. Number one is Snohomish, Washington, a small town about 20 minutes north of Bothell. Because the place has a small town feel, it's the perfect getaway from a busy, bustling life. And because it's a short drive away, you're there and back in one day. In Snohomish, the historical downtown is a must. It's a busy shopping street next to the River Trail, full of local shops and restaurants. When you're here, definitely visit some of the antique shops. The stores carry unique items you won't find anywhere else. I also recommend walking around the streets so you can enjoy the history here and especially the historical architecture. The restaurants here are local and amazing. You will find wine cellars, pubs, delis, you name it. My favorite here is the Snohomish Pie Company. Delicious, scrumptious pies, freshly baked every single day. The store also offers soups, salads, coffee. It's a great place to relax and take a break at. When you're ready to head home, please take a piece of pie to go. Number two, definitely Kirkland just south of Bothell on 405. When you're in Kirkland, downtown and waterfront are great places to go. The main strip on Kirkland is a promenade, full of local shops, boutiques, and restaurants. My recommendations are Zeke's Pizza, Homegrown, and Gelato. After food, take a walk down to the waterfront to the Marina Park. It may be a little empty now in January, but trust me, in the summertime, it's crowded. You can play at the beach, have fun with water sports, have a picnic, go on a boat ride in the middle of Lake Washington, and take a stroll on the boardwalk. Don't stop at the waterfront though. There's also Peter Kirk Park, named after the founder of the city of Kirkland. The park is an open space that welcomes everyone with public amenities like a swimming pool, basketball court, a baseball field, and even a skateboard park. Number three is downtown Bellevue. It's about 30 minutes away from Bothell and so worth the drive. When I'm here, I love visiting the downtown Bellevue Park. If you have kids, the playground is a must. It's the biggest playground that I've ever seen around the area. There's so much to do here. For exercise, a walk or jog around the perimeter of the park. You can also picnic at the green space or play sports. It's a great time here. If you want to stay indoors, no problem. Across the street is Bellevue Square Mall and Lincoln Square Mall. They're all connected with common spaces open to the general public. On the third floor of the mall, there's Kids Cove, an indoor playground for little ones. And of course, restaurants, shops, high-end department stores across the Sky Bridge in Lincoln Square. There's an arcade, a bowling alley, a movie theater, and other recreational facilities. There's something here for everyone and great for rainy days. If you've ever ridden the Kingston Ferry across the Puget Sound, you've been to Edmonds, a quiet waterfront city, 20 minutes west of Bothell. Edmonds is quaint, unique. It's downtown full of local commerce, and its waterfront area offers many activities. Because it's next to the Puget Sound, the overall atmosphere is beachy, calm, and very Pacific Northwest. I highly recommend the Edmonds Marina Park. You can kayak, have a bonfire, play beach volleyball, treasure hunt, and enjoy the beautiful scenery. No matter what you do, you're going to have a great time here. Last but certainly not least, Makotio Lighthouse and Beach Park. When we have out-of-town guests, 
I always take them here. Makotio is also next to the Puget Sound, just north of Edmonds. So the general environment is calm and peaceful. The lighthouse is a historical landmark and Makotio is also a ferry terminal. That takes you straight to the famous Whidbey Island. This is a great space with open scenic views, walking trails, water sports. If you're hungry, there are restaurants nearby like the famous Ivar's Chowder House. I love it here, I hope you do too. Whether you're new to living in Bothell or considering moving to Bothell, today's location are short getaways that will enhance your lifestyle because it's always fun exploring our surroundings and embracing where we live. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Coming up next week, we're getting deeper in living in Bothell and visiting the top five grocery stores that you will likely frequent when you're living in Bothell, Washington. Again, my name is Nanan. I'm a local realtor in Bothell, Washington. For real estate needs, contact me with the information in the bio of this channel. See you next time.